All right, y'all. There's a preview video for this week's auction. Looking good. It is full. Pack, pack, pack. But you know what? We're still going to be done at 1030. Just like we always are. Even though you get it in your head, some people, that we're going to be here all night, it's not the case. Up front takes a little while, and after that, it do goes double time. So, anyway, I just wanted to say that. Another thing I wanted to say is, that, is if you don't have a plan for getting your stuff out of here, and you're buying a bunch of big stuff because it's cheap, just, just don't buy it, okay? Just please. I don't mean to be rude, but... You know, get a plan in place before you buy something big. Thank you very much. All right, so there's a cool buffet there, nice, or a sideboard, whatever, nice carved pieces. Parking meter. There's a turnstile from Waterville, Kansas. It was bought at an auction there. Uh, child's pump organ, a neat old piece. I mean, it apparently works. You know, the straps I think need you know need to be hooked in there. We don't know how to do it. Don't want to mess it up. So, then there's a whole lot of jewelry on this table. A lot of cool stuff. Um, a lot of vintage stuff. Some of it will sell individually. Some of it will sell the whole box. It's like a bunch of leather cuffs and. Vintage boxes there, vintage cigar boxes, rhinestones, and you might find some sterling in here. It would not surprise me. Nice brooches, and there's a lot of like Tibetan, you know, uh, stones and fossils, raw amber. Look at that little guy there. What the heck is that? That's cool. These this is, these are really neat. You know the chains on them. If you want a better chain, get a better chain. A lot of them are beaded and you know things like that. But it's really the pendant. There's an old doctor's bag and some hand-tooled leather, a uh, navy Donald Duck cap. More neat stuff in this case. BF Goodrich, Safety League, what license plate topper or something. There's turquoise. Um, more jewelry, more sterling rings. There's some uh, 1927, 37 half crowns, 500 silver. More coins in here, more silver coins. Uh, U.S., a lot of other countries, a lot of silver in there. Um, same thing, we jump over here. There's some Morgans, there's some Peace. Um, pretty neat. Canadian 25 cent currency, a nickel album, penny album, a lot of them in there. Um, and here's some more jewelry, more rings. Really cool. Again, kind of that Tibetan style. A lot of them are really big. Smacking rings. There's brooches, vintage brooches. Um, then we move over here. Here's a great alto saxophone. Soprano. God, gosh, darn it. <laughs> Soprano saxophone. Low pitch. Low pitch. Elkhart, Indiana, marked the Martin, which is odd. Um, really old saxophone in really great shape. Looks like it has newer pads on it. French made mouthpiece. Um, new case, of course. The old case would be falling apart by now. Can't believe I said alto again. <laughs> and then there's that doll from uh, New Mexico. Uh, Shiprock, New Mexico. Shiprock, New Mexico. So probably a Navajo piece. I mean, I'm sure you look at the pictures, there's more detail, but that a lot of work went into that. That is one of the coolest, you know, Native American pieces we have. Um, and more stuff in the case, some BB guns, old Budweiser tray, balancing Donald in the original box. Here's a highlight here, this uh, 
Hagstrom bass guitar, hollow body electric bass guitar, um, H A G S T R O M. <laughs> it looks brand new. It's this thing's straight out of the woodwork. It's like a little time capsule. It even has the original tags in there and a guy's set list. Set list and lyrics. from right here around the Kansas City area so nice scale pieces there Let's see I guess we have some stuff on the floor it's like a punch bowl some handkerchiefs and such killer old baby buggy uh, pram with wood spoke wheels and so it's wood wheels that's that's old uh, these boxes up front these crates that's Pepsi Cola old Pepsi Cola this is a uh, beaver easy worker die stock nice beaver on there printed on there really neat oh I like this two-seater bicycle built for two it's a Schwinn um, seems to be in in, in good shape too. air uh, tires hold air and Vaughn and Chad riding it around. Look at that big bobbin full of thread there. We have a lot more stuff from that uh, sewing lady too this time. So we'll be getting to that here pretty quick. Um, neat little Lego, Lego display, store display, big box of buttons. These are, are nice sterling. Uh, Weighted sterling bases, really nice etchings on those. Hey, there's a Swamp Thing mask. And there's some hats, Stetsons, hopefully, I'm not sure, I'm not gonna grab one right now. Neat old singer there. Yamaha practice amp. Winston guitar. It's a neat old chalkboard, the letters on the front. Alphabet, I mean. Then we've got the Aurora. Um, well, there's the Mother's Worry model there, still wrapped up. Then we've got the Aurora, Frankenstein, Mummy, Dracula, Wolfman. They're still still all in the original wrapper. G.I. Joe's there with the box. G.I. Joe with the motorcycle and more sewing stuff. Look, check that out. Sewing ladies. It's filled up with thread. The old Wonder Bread display sign. And then this, I think it was used as a jewelry display. It's basically a big freaking pincushion. So, you know, a lot of uses for that. Go back here, a nice piece of Southwest art. Uh, really, really well done. Check the photos, you know, for the. Uh, artist it looks like Dirk Schneider Dirk Schneider's I think that's what it is 85 that's a cool Russian 1980 Olympics poster Soviet not Russian then there's some more like there's Lego signs they're like kind of this heavy fiberboard Lego signs be neat you know kids room or whatever people like like them some Legos it looks like a plaza piece there let me wander on down the line it's an old optometrist diploma from 1921 neat sign little little beat everybody loves signs it seems Oh, that looks like a Spangler. There you go. In case of boredom, break glass. Haha. <laughs> the PlayStation thing in there. Uh, Ion USB turntable. Um, there's another spool holder. That's a neat, a neat, unique piece somebody made up. Uh, jewelry display. An old window frame. 
or a screen window and then put all these hobnails in there and burlap on the back so I get, let you get a good look at it there for jewelry display MTV marked singing machine kind of neat light beer sign outer neon is broken light beer lights up but is weak transformer works well so there you go on that uh, Missouri rep theater costume stuff um, you know this looks like a West Point jacket yeah nope Thorngate uniforms you know these were for like Shakespearean performances to kind of give your body that Shakespearean shape I guess neat little denim jacket Levi jacket bunch of patches on it some leather quilt um, okay not really sure where we'll go after that so I'm just gonna cruise down over here just because it's easier but we might end up going to the other side first but I'm gonna go over here neat the eye the book the light poor light makes studying hard don't slump when you do your homework defective eyes hurt grades and health 1950s good stuff there you know, there's a tear in there, but really good shape. These, I can't believe how good of shape these are in. Uh, get that Norge Finmark. University of Kansas City, Department of Geology and Geography. Try to find a date here real quick. Oh, somebody's even signed that one. Huh. There's another one there. Russian Empire marked. It still has Prussia on there, which is rare. Ottoman Empire. Of course, it's probably just showing you know, the history, but pretty cool. England, Ireland, Scotland. And some Native American blankets and such. There's a multi-piece construction U.S. flag. Union tools stand there. Pretty neat table a little bitty chair um, coming over here on component stereo there's a neat need a uh, singer I think it's a singer signature Montgomery Ward signature good you know, original case apparently these guys are coming back I haven't seen it down here but that is the word on the street. There's a neat old vintage console stereo, nice and small. Bud Light sign. There's some stand-ups. Ham's Beer, Alfred E. Newman. What's her name? Uh, Roy Rogers, Dale Evans. Some sort of scantily clad model. Here's a surround sound system, RCA surround sound. There's a HD projector there. Stuff like that. And check this out. All these jars full of buttons all of these jars full of buttons craziness never seen so many buttons Olympia typewriter super clean some more tools Dremels kind of craft boxes more little look those little miniature chair pin cushions more little buttons this lady was a Crafting sewing machine. Um, some cool stuff on the wall here. Some Audubon kind of prints. Um, and then these. I, don't, I think these might be original. They're nicely framed. You know, they're not those cheap freaking Pier 1 frames. And they look like they have some age to them. I haven't gotten right in there with loop yet. But, you know, they're not, you know, flimsy. You know what I'm talking about. There's a Legos vinyl sign. Neat little tiled mirror over there. Then look at all this little fabric swatches. Ready to make a quilt, are you? Now you got some stuff to do it. All organized. Sad irons. Um, more of that kind of stuff. 
you know you ladies know more about this than we do we may have some stuff because we've got some sewing machines coming up some of these might go to some of those so if you want to if you come in for preview and want to help us with that that's always appreciated one more thread more remnants fabric um, yeah you know just kind of and more of the same thread fabric here's a dollhouse all these little miniature pieces in there and we're gonna take these out and put them in a box or something as it looks like it went through a tornado or dad came home drunk again tore the place up oh, that's, so, that's ridiculous um, more just sewing stuff. I mean, it's crazy. Look at these big Scrabble Scrabble pieces, handmade Scrabble pieces. These Mac computers. We probably sold the monitors that went with them last week. They were hooked up and working. So I don't know. You're on your own with the cords and, and things like that. Um, you know, as we can't. If we're not the ones that take apart a computer, we can't hardly get it back. You know, get it back together. Justify that time. So. Um, if you ever do to, to decide to sign a computer, don't take it apart before we pick it up. Um, yeah, more sewing stuff, more Legos. There's a Lego dump bin in its original box. There's a little kind of sewing chest, stool thing. A little sewing table there, sewing machine fits in the top there. Um, I missed this. There's a kind of a crocheted or macrame or whatever kind of a lamp, hanging lamp stained glass or painted glass dolls and cupcakes that guy's kind of cool this little triptych here s and j made out of crayons heart made out of crayons freaking futurama embroidered huh a lot of time a lot of money went into that there's three wooden ladders and the sewing machine table. I know some of these are worth a lot of money. Old Singer, Little Bitty Singers, Big Singers, Computer Singers, Quantum XL1000, XL150, XL6000. We have cords with most of them. You know, you could try them out. You know, I don't really know what to. A lot of them have tags, you know, saying that something's not quite right with this one, this works. But a lot of them look, you know, barely used. It's kind of a neat little display. I guess that's a display of different sewing machine parts. Um, hey, solar powered attic fan. Uh huh. Yeah. Um, here's a big kind of counter height table. Uh, with the, uh, you know, you unlock the leaves and you pull it out. Uh, you might look at the pictures on that. Uh, sun's blocking that out. It looks like a full size sleigh bed, white with three white little three drawer chests. Uh, this is a neat piece of furniture. Just sit these drawers. Oh, well, there's what, 12 drawers? I think it's all one piece. Or maybe that, or maybe it's three pieces. I don't know. Come in, check it out. A little stair step, um, drawers, storage, unique piece. Looks like an old console, stereo, or TV, something like that. This is neat. It's painted white with these little crystal knobs, but. That's a well-made piece of furniture. There's another bed. Looks full to me. Headboard. That was headboard was hooked to the wall, so you know there it is. You can figure that out. Another white a cabinet, computer cabinet, something like that. Theater chairs, reclining theater chairs. There's three of them. And then. There's this kind of uh, vintage 60s, 70s game table with uh, club chairs. Might have seen it before. 
there was a bit of buyer's remorse going on with that which leads me again to say folks you know if you buy something here and you don't have a plan for picking it up just i know it's hard if it's going for cheap to not bid on it but it puts us it puts us kind of in a weird situation so please um a native american piece there a little stools more mid-century stuff there's quite a bit of mid-century stuff in here actually I like that maybe not be the sexiest one in the world but it's neat green style green color that style like mid-century folding chairs over there and a table a little storage uh, bin back there a little side table green chairs some painted step stools sort of kind of you know French provincial mid-century ish coffee table side table these are lane marked lane those will be nice more sewing machines my god there's a lot of sewing machines and this this is cool mid-century desk with green chair and you know more of that stuff okay we'll go I guess we'll go over here here's a Toro 6.5 it works fires right up runs here's a Cub Cadet LT 1045 um, runs starts right up um, then we go over here there's more clothing, you know, uh, Apple. This lady worked for Apple in the early days, so there's some, some kind of specialty stuff in there. More sewing, more thread, more fabric. There's batting, neat little trash can. What do we have here? Oh, it's more fabric. Boxes and boxes and boxes. Apparently, I learned that people who are really into sewing do not mess around and they keep all their all the stuff and this lady was super organized with it too so um, that's always always helpful a bunch of toolboxes some of them are painted kind of funky colors which is neat some of them have tools um, sand umbrella yeah, just crazy more sewing stuff You know, at first, you know, down here, we, we don't know that much about sewing stuff. And we started selling some of it. And then we realized, wow. Think of all the fabric and all the things that we've left in all the houses. Um, apparently, it's very desirable and somewhat expensive. So we humped all this stuff out. Look. All that fabric, all that fabric, all that fabric. Forget that TV. You didn't even see that. Somehow that made it onto the truck, but we were helping the guy out too. It does have a DVD and VHS in it, so maybe somebody will want it. They are hard to sell. More fabric, 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 fabric. Okay, looking in here, sewing books, stitching books, crafting books, quilting books, sewing machine books. I mean, it just doesn't stop. Um, so there's plush toys in like brand new condition with its tags still on them. Um, camping stuff. It's kind of neat. Hand handmade piece there. I don't know. You know, a lot of the stuff we would have overlooked and thrown away or whatever, but. You ladies taught us a lesson. Theater seating. Chad's utilizing it. Then there's a bunch of Homer Laughlin china. A bunch of different china patterns. Um, there's a Dyson, one of those ball, Dyson balls. 
apparently super crazy expensive. It's a neat old Kirby, a metal one. People like those because they don't break. Um, more China. Um, I think the pictures. So this is, uh, dang it. This is Homer Laughlin pattern here, kind of blue pattern with flowers. Um, I believe this is Homer Laughlin, no, Patek uh, Johnson Brothers, uh, Parik, I'm sorry, Parik, Patek, <laughs> Parik Johnson Brothers, England, kind of blue pattern. So all this whole set's going to go for one money. Down here, the set with the flowers, I think it was just USA marked. More stuff on the floor, more sewing, more crafting. I can't get to your phone call right now in the middle of a video. What's this saying? Fifty percent chance it's a telemarketer telling me that whatever. Some rollerblading stuff, some karate stuff, more crafting stuff. And look at these denim. I mean, just squares and squares and squares and squares of denim. It goes on. It doesn't stop. It really doesn't stop. More Lego, like advertising pieces. Pretty cool. Um, laser tag game kit. Some Steins. Budweiser related stuff. Toys. More toys. More crafting and sewing stuff. Um, some vintage t shirts. Looks like scout stuff in there. More crafting stuff. More plush toys with the tags on them. This is a freaking Futurama Bender costume. Handmade costume. I guess that's what that is. What else could that be? Weird. Yeah, so I imagine I imagine that's probably the way we'll go in the auction. You know, close enough anyway. But this is but this is a good table here. There's a lot of good stuff on here. Neat uh, sports jerseys. And so I think that's it, guys. I might have missed something, but you can come in for preview Wednesday, 11 to 1. Or uh, we open the doors at 5, start selling at 6 on Thursday. Thanks a lot.